501 is heading south. I almost missed it. Barefoot. Beautiful. Mother's Day in the UP. ELS 501 is heading south. Been wondering where where this locomotive was. Well, I mean, I knew it was enchanting, but we hadn't seen it in uh, quite a few days. Oh, it's a little dark where I'm sitting here. But anyway, I'm using my cell phone here today. My son uh, actually just gave me an iPhone as well to use, so I may try doing that. My camera, I don't know. It's great for pictures. It does do really good video when it works. But there was a train the other day that after I was done filming it, I realized my camera did not record it. So that's gonna be a problem. If I can't depend on my camera, then we're gonna have problems, so. I don't know, I'm seriously debating about just switching over to all cell phone you know, recordings. I think it's an iPhone 7 that my son has given me or to use so we'll have to see man this is a long train huh my wife and my son just ran to the store so they've got the car I can't even chase this I managed to get a shirt on just in time Beautiful morning, 60s. I'm sitting in the house, not many clothes on, I'll just say it that way. Enjoying a beautiful Mother's Day, getting ready to go on vacation. We leave Wednesday. Just the wife and I will be renting a car and heading south. All right, I hear it crossing by Alter Metal right now. And I can see the train is still across Brighting. So if you look on Google Map, that'll give you an idea how long this train is. Man, it's still going. I guess we know what 501 was doing up in Channing. They were clearing the yard out. Yeah, we're looking at about 10 days away from home here. We're gonna go down to Memphis and spend a day with some family down there. And then we're gonna head on down toward, towards near Orlando. Spend about three days with family there. And then we're gonna hit the Gulf Coast near Biloxi and Gulfport. Spend a couple of days there. And on the way home, well, as a gift of myself for my 50th birthday, we're gonna stop at a crystal mine and mine some crystals. Some quartz crystals, some pretty cool ones. Check out these cars, those are pretty cool, huh? Huh. 
Aha! Cemento Campana! What is that? Is it Mexican? I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, it's still coming. Who will it ever end? So yeah, we're going down uh, in uh, this crystal mine. Like I said, you can pay, I think it's like 35 bucks a day per person. You can go in. Any crystals you find, you keep. So it'll be like a day or two before we head home. So I'm thinking, may as well fill the trunk up, huh? Quartz crystals, I think it'll be a pretty cool adventure. A whole day out there, digging in dirt, filling buckets, having fun. I don't know of a better way to spend the day to relax. And again, funny part is, it'll be on my 50th birthday, so what a better way to celebrate your birthday than to do something fun and something you love to do. Well, is this train ever gonna end? How come I expect to see a DPU on the back or somewhere? My God. Oh, I think I see the end. Wow. I just cannot believe how long this train was. Well, I will keep recording filming trains as much as I can from here until uh, we leave. Make sure you subscribe. Make sure you're a subscriber because more than likely I will be doing live streams during our trip. I might post videos, but I may do live streams, I'll just tell you now, so. Guys, make sure to hit that thumbs up, hit that subscribe button so you see these videos. Share these videos if you would, that always gets me seen and uh, helps me out there. And make a comment below, because commenting always helps us on YouTube, so. Ooh, we got a orange Freddy today. Man, that was a long train. You guys have a fantastic Mother's Day. And happy Mother's Day to all you great mothers out there.